Okay, Tony. Okay, Corey. Now that the engine's off, I can tell you what's going on here. <clears throat> All right, so the other day, I put the uh, gear pressure sender in and the temp sender uh, where it belongs. Hooked everything up. And uh, the uh, gear pressure is pegged on the gauge at 400. And when we shift it into neutral, it'll briefly drop down to 200 and bounce right back up when you put it in gear. I reversed the two leads on the end of the sender. Same deal. As you can see, I've got the right sender and the right thing. Trans pressure sender right off the uh, harness. Separate line going up to the to the uh, the harness that you guys sent. So going up to forward here. If we go underneath, uh, actually I'll show you how I got everything set up here. Corey, you're correct. Um, the pins only go in one way. That's how I've got it set up, just as you gave it to me. Everything's nice and secure and all greased up. If I go down below um, here, you can see you sent me a red lead for boost. The boost gauge is right there with two leads. And you can see that I've got one lead on the boost and one on the gear. Um, what I didn't do is I did not swap leads, but the boost does not work. Um, and you can see where I came up with the gear temp. <clears throat> one lead wired way to it. And uh, there's not much else I can do about the wiring, so I'm kind of befuddled here, but I'll let you guys figure it out. Don't don't mind the uh, spaghetti mess. That'll be all cleaned up over the winter. And you can see where I got the uh, leak here on the helm pump. We'll take care of it over the winter, too. I probably caused that. Motherfucker. Oh, sorry. Didn't mean to swear. Um, that's about it. I'll send you some uh, parameters. Oh, just so you know, and I'll tell you right now. Uh, I got a no-load on the engine with a photo tack of 3300. I got a wide open uh, photo tack of 3040 and the tachometer was reading 2880. So the question is, uh, I guess the question is if we've got this thing propped properly. Uh, I can't believe the engine's working that hard. We're only, uh, you know, we're only, we're only doing 750 on uh, your EGT gauge, so not quite sure what to say about that. Uh, hold on one second, I'm gonna show you one other thing here I want you to take a peek at. I'll show you how hot the engine's running uh, just by taking a look at it. We just get the hatch open, hold on just a second. If I open up the hatch, you can see uh, Get some pretty good heat in number six back there. Uh, but other than that, uh, we don't seem to be generating too much heat. Um, turbo pipes, okay, so uh, anyway, that's a scoop of that. All right, and there's the uh, boost gauge, by the way. I had to put a uh, stud on the bottom of that just to lift it up. It was buttoned up against the uh, fuel line there. So that's about it. I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.